Yeah, well, I mean, there is some legitimacy to what he's talking about, though, and that like safety and and like uh, and quality are really important concerns. And this is a brand new type of vaccine. We don't have vaccine factories all over the world that are tested and and good. Um, like, I do support waiving the patents, but like that's not going to lead to a massive increase in vaccines. Like the real solution to this problem with what's happening in India is wealthy countries that have already gotten a bunch of vaccines like pre-ordered, particularly United States, Canada, and the UK need to pay young people to stay home and continue quarantining and send those additional vaccines to India. That's yeah. what needs to happen. That's the real solution to this problem in India right now. I mean, specifically of course, but like, but you know, all over the world and, and take care of, of essential workers like healthcare and like seniors and like wealthy countries need to just pay young people to continue to stay home. Of course, <laughs> that's not happening in this country and that's been the no, failure since no. the beginning, okay. but, but like- No, it's which, definitely I mean, not happening. Yeah, the, the IP thing, like, yeah, like it's not, it's not nothing, but like releasing the IPs doesn't solve this problem. The real solution is like wealthy countries should, I've already spelled it out. Right, like, that's yeah, what the real yeah. solution is. 